Good afternoon. My name is Joel Montgomery, and I am the Director of International Expansion at Endeavor. Uh, Endeavor, if you haven't heard of it, is a global nonprofit that supports high-impact entrepreneurs in emerging countries. And the light bulb moment for Endeavor uh, actually happened in, of all places, a taxi cab in Buenos Aires, Argentina. Our CEO and founder, uh, Linda Rotenberg, um, who actually was working at Ashoka at the time, um, so there are a lot of influences from Ashoka in Endeavor, uh, was talking to the taxi driver, as she often does, and she uh, came to find out that the taxi driver had a PhD in engineering. And she thought, man, talking about being overqualified, uh, she said, you know, no, no, no disrespect, but, you know, why are you finding yourself driving a taxi? And he said, there are no jobs. This is all I can do to feed my family. And being the typical entrepreneurship passionista that she is, she said, well, why don't you become an entrepreneur? And he said, well, what's that? And she realized at the time, there wasn't even a word for entrepreneur or entrepreneurship in Spanish. If the word entrepreneur is not even in the lexicon of a country, how in the world are young people supposed to try to aspire to be that? Um, you know, we uh, currently have 11 offices around the world, um, two on the African continent. I'm actually uh, setting up an office now in East Africa. And what we see uh, is that there's lots of entrepreneurial activity in Africa. The challenge is that most of that is necessity-based. There are entrepreneurs that are hawking their wares basically because that's the only thing they can do to put food on the, on the table. And as you see the country progress, the, the level of uh, entrepreneurial activity actually decreases uh, because there are now more jobs. And as the country further develops, the entrepreneurial activity begins to increase. But that's a different variety. Those are opportunity entrepreneurs. But again, in Africa, many of the opportunity entrepreneurs that we see are actually wheelers and dealers. They're also known as tender entrepreneurs. They're people that have you know, great uh, connections with the government and are able to, you know, get tenders that way. They're basically looking to get rich. They're not looking to build a sustainable business. Endeavor, on the other hand, is looking for high-impact entrepreneurs, which is another type of the opportunity entrepreneurs. Those are the most innovative entrepreneurs in a country. Those are the entrepreneurs Magat mentioned earlier. It's all about jobs. Those are the entrepreneurs that are going to be creating hundreds, if not thousands, of jobs. Those are the entrepreneurs that are going to be scaling their businesses outside of Africa. Those are the types of entrepreneurs that Endeavor is seeking out. And so we see our work in two main areas. The first is finding entrepreneurs. So over the past 13 years, we've reviewed over 23,000 entrepreneurs, selected just over 500. So the bar is very, very high. But of those entrepreneurs, they have now created 130,000 jobs and $3.5 billion in revenues. That is how you develop a country. It's about, uh, about you know, identifying the innovators and giving them support necessary to really kind of knock it out of the park. So with that, I, I, will, uh, I will step down. And I'm, I'm looking forward to an interesting discussion. Thanks, Joel. Andreas.